Glycolizide, sold under the brand name Diamicron among others, is an anti-diabetic medication used to treat diabetes mellitus type 2. It is used when dietary changes, exercise, and weight loss are not enough. It is taken by mouth. Side effect may include low blood sugar, vomiting, abdominal pain, rash, and liver problems. Use by those with significant kidney problems, liver problems, or who are pregnant is not recommended. Glycolizide is in the sulfonylurea family of medications. It works mostly by increasing the release of insulin. Glycolizide was patented in 1966 and approved for medical use in 1972. It is on the World Health Organization's list of essential medicines, the most effective and safe medicines needed in a health system. The wholesale cost in the developing world is about 2.46 to 3 United States dollars and 92 cents per month. In the United Kingdom, a month of medication costs the NHS about 2.12 pounds. It is not available for sale in the United States. Medical uses Glycolizide is used for control of hyperglycemia in glycolizide responsive diabetes mellitus of stable, mild, non ketosis prone, type 2 diabetes. It is used when diabetes cannot be controlled by proper dietary management and exercise or when insulin therapy is not appropriate. National Kidney Foundation 2012 update claims that glycolizide does not require dosage uptitration even in end stage kidney disease. Contraindications Type 1 diabetes Hypersensitivity to sulfonylureas Severe renal or hepatic failure, but relatively useful in mild renal impairment e.g. CKD stage 3 Pregnancy and lactation Adverse effects Hypoglycemia, while it was shown to have the same efficacy as glimepiride, one of the newer sulfonylureas, the European Guide study has shown that it has approximately 50% less hypoglycemic confirmed episodes in comparison with glimepiride. Interactions Hyperglycemic action may be caused by danazol, chlorpromazine, glucocorticoids, progestogens, or beta-2 agonists. Its hypoglycemic action may be potentiated by phenylbutazone, alcohol, fluconazole, beta blockers, and possibly ACE inhibitors. It has been found that rifampin increases glycolyzide metabolism in humans in vivo. Overdose Glycolyzide overdose may cause severe hypoglycemia, requiring urgent administration of glucose by IV and monitoring. Mechanism of action Glycolizide selectively binds to sulfonylurea receptors SIR1, on the surface of the pancreatic beta cells. It was shown to provide cardiovascular protection as it does not bind to sulfonylurea receptors SUR2A, in the heart. This binding effectively closes the K plus ion channels. This decreases the efflux of potassium from the cell which leads to the depolarization of the cell. This causes voltage-dependent Ca++ ion channels to open increasing the Ca++ influx. The calcium can then bind to and activate calmodulin which in turn leads to exocytosis of insulin vesicles leading to insulin release. The mouse model of Modi diabetes suggested that the reduced glycolyzide clearance stands behind their therapeutic success in human Modi patients, but Urbanova et al. found that human Modi patients respond differently and that there was no consistent decrease in glycolyzide clearance in randomly selected HNF1A Modi and HNF4A Modi patients. Its classification has been ambiguous, as literature uses it as both a first generation and second generation sulfonylurea. Properties According to the Biopharmaceutical Classification System BCS, glycolyzide falls under the BCS class II drug, which is poorly soluble and highly permeable, water solubility equals 0.027 mg per liter, hypoglycemic sulfonylurea, restoring first peak of insulin secretion, increasing insulin sensitivity. Glycemia-independent hemovascular effects, antioxidant effect. No active circulating metabolites. 
Metabolism Glycoside undergoes extensive metabolism to several inactive metabolites in human beings, mainly methylhydroxyglycoside and carboxyglycoside. CYP2C9 is involved in the formation of hydroxyglycoside in human liver microsomes and in a panel of recombinant human P450s in vitro. But the pharmacokinetics of glycoside mister are affected mainly by CYP2C19 genetic polymorphism instead of CYP2C9 genetic polymorphism. References External links Servier Advanced Clinical Trial on Diabetes